Hey, what's up guys, how's it up here? And today we're gonna to be taking a look at this problem where your phone might be connected to the internet or to the router, but your phone says connected, but no internet connection. So let's see how we can solve this. There are a few ways that you can solve this. So without any further ado, let's get into this video and let's see how it's done. So there can actually be a number of ways why your Wi-Fi is connected but there's no internet access. So first thing that I would recommend you to do is actually go onto your router and uh, basically check whether all the wires are connected properly or maybe even restart your router and then try connecting your Wi-Fi again. And if that does not work, uh, you can just go onto your settings. So basically go onto your phone and then go onto your settings. And once you're in your settings, just go to the internet settings and select on the Wi-Fi that you want to connect to. So you must be already connected and it must be showing an exclamatory mark over here. So all you want to do is just basically forget this network. And once you've forgot this network, just uh, go on this network again and then enter in your password. So I'll enter in the password. So yeah guys, so I've entered the password and uh, as you can see, it's obtaining the IP address right now. So as you can see, it says that it has been connected. So this should solve your problem. And if even this does not solve your problem, and you, if, you are, if you still have the exclamatory mark, uh, the next step that you can do is just basically go onto this again and forget the network. And once you forgot the network, basically go back in again and then type your password again. So, so once you've typed the password, uh, you wanna go onto the advanced options and then scroll down and then uh, you'll find this IP settings, change that to static. So once you have that changed to static, you need to manually enter your IP address. So everything should be the same except for the last three digits. So let's go ahead and put that in there. So you can put in anything between 1 to 255 in the last digits. And we let the gateway be the same. And the DNS also has to be the same. DNS one has to be uh, four times eight and the DNS two has to be uh, 8.8.4.4. .4. So once you have this down, uh, you can just click on connect and make sure you already have your password in there and make sure the password is correct. So you just need to click connect. And once you've clicked connect, the problem should go away now. You should have uh, the internet connection. And even if like, if, if this doesn't work for some reason, just maybe start, uh, try restarting your router and restarting your phone. And uh, so that should fix the problem because this is all we can do to fix the problem. So yeah guys, this should have probably helped you. And if it did, please do leave a like and please share this video with your friends and family to let them know about this and save them from this. So yeah guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.